So my guess is that if you're watching this video, you can't quite get your avatars in Zoom to work. Allow me to explain. A couple months ago, I put out a video that introduced this idea of avatars coming to Zoom. And while the video got a lot of views for my channel, I received a lot of comments with one specific problem, and that was people who were not able to access avatars in Zoom. Now I tried my best to reply to them, but I did want to create this video just to share some of the reasons why your avatars might not be working. And I want to be upfront, I don't quite have a solution for this problem, but if you're interested in learning about why the avatars may not be working on your laptop the way that they worked on mine, hopefully this video will be helpful. But before I get into this, I would love it if you could consider subscribing to my YouTube channel where each week I'll be sharing new videos on a variety of topics, including my Zoom avatars video that I spoke of earlier. So thanks for your consideration and now let's talk about Zoom avatars. So like I said, the most frequent comment that I got on the video was that A, users had upgraded to a version of Zoom that was version 5.10 or higher. They were able to see the avatars tab, but when they clicked on it, nothing happened. It kind of looks like this. So if you have Zoom version 5 or 10 or greater, and you're on an account that isn't managed by an organization like work or school, here's why I think the avatars are not working on your device. That's because your computer does not meet the specifications for Zoom avatars. So let's check this out. This is right on the Zoom support page. I'll leave the link in the comments. If you scroll down, there are prerequisites for avatars. You can see, like we talked about, it has to be version 5.10 or higher. And then there are specific system requirements. So right over here in this box are the system requirements for any Windows system. If you scroll down a little, you can see the system requirements for Mac. And then if I go at the bottom, you can see the system requirements for iOS. Now, if you don't have the system requirements, that option for avatars is not going to be available. I think it's going to look something like this, but I couldn't quite replicate this on any of the devices that I have. So I'm sorry that I wasn't able to find a solution, but I do think that these are some of the reasons why your avatars might not be working. So again, if there's questions, leave them in the comment section below and I'll do my best to answer any questions. And if you have topics or videos that you would like to see, go ahead, leave a message in the comments. I'd love to create some content for everyone. Thanks again for watching and have a great day.